This right here is the Golden Fire Axe. No, this is not a Crim copy. This is the Vanilla Crim. And we found the Golden Fire Axe, which is absolutely something that I'd never thought I was going to say. In this video, I'm going to be talking about uh, how I got the Fire Axe. Then I'm going to be talking about what the Fire Axe does. And at the end of the video, I'm going to be talking about a little giveaway I'm doing to uh, give away the Fire Axe. So I was just doing my thing, right? I was playing Criminality at 4.30 in the morning for some odd reason. And I was opening a mystery crate, right? And I was getting all these terrible drops. I got like a Fire Axe, a uh, Tech 9, a Shiv, and we got a Rambo as well. Yeah, how good is that? Um, and I didn't think much of it, right? I thought I was just getting terrible drops. But then I realized that uh, while I was making like my acoustic little, um, my acoustic little snow angel, I realized that the uh, skins on the Fire Axes were different, which is weird because I've got my little oak skin on it, right? But then this one was just some like, regular skinned fire axe and i thought that was a bit odd but then what i realized was that this is actually no ordinary fire axe because i picked this thing up right and it was called the other uh, g fire axe and i was like oh crap it's the golden fire axe right because I, I didn't think this thing was real i thought this thing was just like a um just like an admin weapon but apparently this is a real thing in the game yeah so we can kind of see like first up in the uh top corner it's got like a, um, so I'm holding a deagle, right? But it's only 3.5 out of, um, 10 slots. So, this, uh, fire axe actually weighs zero slots, which is pretty cool. So you can rock, like, a, uh, tier 3 RPG, LMG, whatever you want, kit. And you can also have this fire axe as well, which is pretty neat, I reckon. Yeah, another thing that I found quite odd was, this thing isn't called the Golden Fire Axe, it's just called the G Fire Axe, which I assume is just the abbreviation of Golden. But it was an interesting touch. Probably just a short the name for the uh, UI there. And then, like, another thing I noticed was the, um, the first-person perspective is a bit munted. It's, like, a lot more, uh, your FOV's down a lot more. You hold the fire axe a lot closer to your face, which I, maybe it's just a bug, but I'm not sure. Uh, as you can also see, you do swing the fire axe quite a bit faster, so that's also pretty cool. And of course, we did see in the corner that it can in fact block, which is also pretty neat. Yeah, so after having like a little bit of a play with it, I decided that uh, I didn't really want to lose this thing to an airstrike or something, something crazy like that. So I just decided to uh, log from the game and just leave it there for a little bit. Right, so I decided to talk to my friend uh, Secret, and basically he's like a trial mod for the game, right? And I sent him the, uh, the Golden Fire Axe, because I was like, oh, I have it. Yeah, I have the Golden Fire Axe. How crazy is that? And he's, like, understandably pretty surprised. Um, but basically, yeah, I told him I logged with it because I didn't really want to lose it. And he's like, oh, all right, that's valid. Uh, he said that he knows, like, nothing about the Golden Fire Axe. But um, apparently it's, like, crazy rare from mystery crates and airdrops. So apparently he gets them from airdrops too, which is pretty crazy. Uh, he said it's like, it's, like, winning the lottery rare. So it's, like, very rare. Apparently I'm very lucky. Um... And he also said it's different from the admin version for some reason. Uh, basically, the admin version is different to like the uh, the player version because the admin version takes no stamina, whereas the one that you can get from mystery crates and airdrops does take stamina. Now, originally, I was going to like go out with a bang or something, go have a run around with this thing, buy a tier three kit, something crazy like that, kill a bunch of people. But I was looking at my ping and I was like, oh, 350 ping or whatever. Not looking too good. Um, might not be the best idea to go run around with this thing, because I'm probably just going to lose it instantly to some, like, gang of 10 guys, right? But instead, what I thought I'd do was I'd sell it to someone for, like, a thousand Robux, but now I was like, eh, it's kind of heavy, it's just a fire axe. So, um, what I finally decided that I'd do is I'm going to do, like, a kind of giveaway thing, right? And basically, how the giveaway is going to work is I've got a number written down on my desk on a little piece of paper. It's, uh, somewhere between 1 and 10. So, basically, if you guess the correct number, and you only get one shot to guess it, if you guess the correct number, then I'll go ahead and give you the fire axe. So I've got like a little uh, Discord alt account on our uh, screen. Uh, username's poorpoppet2. If you just send the, shoot the account like a little friend request, uh, then you should be able to uh, just DM, just DM like any number between one and 10. And uh, I'll get back to you and I'll tell you if you got the number right or wrong. Remember, you only get one chance, but if you do want to, you can pass the uh, thing on to a friend, and they can also ask, which may uh, increase your chances of getting the uh, the fire axe. But uh, good luck, everyone. Have fun trying to get this axe. But anyways, you can probably tell that this video is um, not very scripted at all, because I was making a bit of a rush. But uh, 
Yeah, we found the golden fire axe. It's real. Woohoo!